Yeah, I literally just got off the phone with him. I think his name's Al, right? Yes. Uh, he literally just bought it from Lamborghini of Dallas, I think. Yep. And okay. how's it going? He just bought it. And before it goes to, where's he from? New York. I think New York. He wants us to give it a once over, make sure it's good. And I think we're going to do our 1,000 horsepower package on it. But he said to give it a once over, look at it, and then call and make sure it's clean. Doing the bill of lighting? Yeah. Okay. This is like the No, the transport's dropping off. Like I said, yeah, he bought it from New York. He's in New York, he bought it, sighted and seen just pictures of it. Uh, Dallas is only four hours from us, so he sent it to us. He said, inspect it, give it a once over, and then I think we're gonna do our 1,000 horsepower package to it. 900 or 1,000, he's, he's still kind of trying to decide. And if we do do 1,000, I think he wants to do like a stage two cam or like a stealth cam. So I'll talk to him more about it, but dude, it does look clean. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? You got the mic on? Oh, okay. Just asking. Yep. <laughs> I heard about what happened Friday. <laughs> yeah. I got the balancer right here. ATI. Super dampener. About to go on this sweet uh, 0 R1 here. No, I have to do each two sprout, two valve springs per cylinder. She'll cheer you up. Whoa, here she comes. The man eater.
cars, dude. I want to do two or three of these every single week. Like, that is so awesome. 861 rear wheel horsepower, 828 rear wheel torque. Monster, dude. Monster. And again, hop in it and drive this thing every day, beat the crap out of it, have nothing to worry about. It doesn't get much better than this, man. Most for your average guy, this is more than enough horsepower. We put Toyos on it, so we'll be able to actually use the horsepower. And we'll go do 6130s in it. It'll go a lot low five, depending on traction. It's just hard to beat it. <laughs> they sound so good. I want another one. You know, off the record, I, I know you really do. I do. Like, this is what I, I want this car. Like, I really do. My blue one was, because it's Admiral Blue, they only built 40 of them. 44 of them like I really want and that what, so what's bad struggling is you don't need no longer need it for an RD car yeah so it'd, it'd be just me to have fun with yeah. which you deserve I know I just got a lot of marketing I want to do still whether it's Z06 stuff C8 stuff and then exotic shit I want to do more of and other stuff even more Dodge stuff more Ford stuff like you'll, you'll, you'll get your exotic one day you'll get your exotic I think so too. I think enough customers will bring me exotic stuff to play it's been with. A, a, a dream. Yes. Since we were kids. So. Yeah, bro. Who wouldn't want to play with Lamborghinis and Ferraris and McLaren? It's like, come on. back to the shop I'll give it a once over make sure she looks good and then uh, off for uh, PPF and ceramic coating all right guys hope you enjoyed this video so far we got Al's beautiful 1901 behind us completed with our thousand horsepower package uh, solid 850 rear wheel horsepower on 93 octane. He is from New York. He bought this car sight unseen. So our performance work is done. And again, 93 octane. Uh, I want to show you all the video, or at least try to make a little video for you guys at home. So most of our thousand horsepower packages for these 19 ZR1s, some customers don't have 93 octane, some have 91. And so every car that we ship, we at least ship one of these with it and the customer can buy more later but want to show you how easy it is all the vets come with that from the factory stick that in open and we usually add one quart pour per full tank of gas and that way if you have 91 octane at least this will get it to 93 a little bit above if you have 93 add a quart to this at least you're probably around 95 to 98 octane and again that's only for racing purposes um, a car like this can be driven every single day, even on 91. Played getting on it a little bit at a time, but if you know you're gonna be racing it hard, that's why I tell my customers to add the fuel additive to it. But yes, our job, complete, performance work complete, new tires on it, complete, check. Again, I love this car, guys, I love this platform. Those of you out there that have 19-01s, please send them my way. I love building them, and I promise you, you will not, um, you will not have second doubts about it. There's no no way to describe it until you have to drive one of these things. You can watch my videos all day long, but until you hop one, hop in and drive one, you just can't explain it. So now our process is done. Now it's going to go to um, 
Where's he going? New York. No. Oh, to your... Uh, it's going to get detailed. Sorry. Now it's going to detail shop around the corner for a full uh, PPF and ceramic coating. And then back to New York, to Al. So first time he sees it, it'll look better than stock. The factory paint on this thing looks good in these videos, but they get all the swirl marks out of it, all the imperfections out of it, and then a full PPF film to keep it nice and safe for when he's beating the crap out of it on the roads. Till next time, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Comment below, as always. Till next time.